What's up, YouTube? CJD here from Chris's Junkyard Designs. Uh, I figured I'd do a quick video to show my um, custom for the two-in-one tow truck challenge. Um, put out by Caliber 50 Customs. I believe he's doing it with Kuda's diecast. They're having a build-off, and he invited everybody to make a tow truck. So you took two castings to make um, one tow truck. So that's the challenge. So I just got it done. So I figured I'd do a quick video. I put some pictures on Instagram already. So this is going to be it right here. Um, so this is basically a 49 Ford COE. I had pictures of the original of these cars and I deleted them or something. So they're gone. But this was like a Star Wars or something. Had that big stupid plastic piece that went in the back here and was all decorated up and everything. So I ripped all that off. Um... Took the whole truck apart, you know, stripped it, all that kind of stuff. And then I took the other mat, the other tow truck, I believe was a matchbox, if I remember right. Um, it was one I got from um, a buddy of mine in the mail, Sammy, I believe it was, sent it to me. Um, so the parts I used from that, I didn't use any of the body of it because it didn't really work with this, but I used the tow hitch, the exhaust pipes, the bumper, the two front wheels. So that's what I used on that tow truck to make this tow truck. The bed is made with um, styrene to cover up the inside there. And then I glued that on there. Uh, I had to do a lot of grinding to get these big wheels to fit in there. And these wheels to fit in there. It was a lot of grinding. But they're in there. And I put the stacks on there. I added some stickers. got some Valvoline. Uh, I put a chain right there so they can chain up the car. They're grabbing, sitting right there, ready to roll. Um, so I just made her all dirtied up. This is called a junkyard hauler. Um, it's an old junkyard truck. They just threw some crap together on it to move some cars around. So put a chain in the front in case they need it. Um, dirtied her all up. The bumper's a little crooked. So this, I took the bumper off that other truck and heated it up with a uh, um, lighter. And when I got it hot enough, I pushed it over the top of this and formed it because it was just a straight grill. And I made it contour to this pretty good. So, and then I glued it on there. But um, just your basic rust and dust. Um, I salt chipped it to begin with. And then I added um, apple barrel paints, the yellow, the red, brown. Did a little bit of them in there. Um, Added some rust wash, added some black wash, um, did some typhus corrosion for the mud around the fenders on the tires and a little bit in the front for some texture and in the back here, so like oil spills or dirt and mud or whatever. Um, painted this silver, gunmetal, these are gunmetal, and these have some blue powder on the top, so it looks like they got a little hot on the tips and then I just dusted it up with some dusting powders some rust some mud dusting powder uh, and that's the blue dusting powder on the top there mm. that's about it just an old junker in the junkyard moving cars around so it's not two bodies in one but it's a lot of parts from the other one to make this so because I just didn't want to take apart this 49. I like it. So I covered up its grill and added the bed and added this and added the tires. I took the, they had real rider tires on it. I took them off, added the pipe. So it's basically two trucks in one. Oh, didn't come out too bad. Let me turn it up on here real quick. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's going to be my entry, guys, into the um, 2 in 1 truck challenge. So you should check out the other guys that are going to do this. I think it's June 1st is the deadline. Um, so if you're not watching Caliber 50 Customs, subscribe to his channel and Kuda's Diecast. And they'll definitely both be doing I think Charles already did a video. Charles Diecast Garage, if I remember right. And I think Caliber did his video already, too. But I don't remember. Mine's all done. I just got my four horsemen build done too a few days ago, so that'll be coming up. 
tomorrow, next day, the video for that, so, all right, hope you guys uh, enjoyed the video, thanks for all the comments, all the likes, take care, have a great night, and a great Memorial Day tomorrow.